Today we're going to talk about what you can learn at home with your Kestrel. All right. So one of the things that I actually teach the guys every week is how to actually calibrate your eye for milling. So this is one of the skill sets. Most of my clients are snipers that have been through sniper school and they've done milling and they know how to do it already. But it's one of the skill sets that we lose very quickly. All right. So what we end up doing, we actually go out on the range, they mill a couple of targets. And this is what I try to get the guys to do because there's no... Uh, there's no sex appeal to milling targets. It's slow. Uh, guys finally get on the range. They got a lot of ammo. They're ready to shoot. And so they don't take the time to keep their milling skills up. So what we end up doing, I have a mill three or four targets. That's it. All right. Now what we need to know first, we're going to go into target. All right. Hit the center button that shows and will highlight TR. Hit the center button again. We're going to scroll down to estimate. Hit that button and it takes us into our mill relation formula. So we're gonna plug in our target size, 12 inches, all right, or 24, or whatever you're milling, all right? So target size, 12 inches. So your image size is what we're going to change, all right? So I just wrote out IS for image size. It actually spells it out. And then it'll give you your range, all right? So now we know, because we're gonna laser the target, the target's 508 meters. All right, so I'm going to change my image size until I see 508. So I'm looking at this while I'm changing this number. So once I get to 0.6, it tells me 508. Well, we can't argue with 0 0.6. 0 0.6 is what a 12-inch target meals to get to 508 meters. But my laser rangefinder told me it's 508. So now I have to look at my reticle and see exactly how I can make that target meal to be 0.6. Because again, this isn't an argument. We're not going, and I hear this from the guys. Well, all I can see is 0.7. And I go, well, it's 0.6. It has to be 0.6, all right? That's the math. And they go, well, to make it be 0.6, I'd have to do this. I'm like, whatever that was, do that every time from now. So again, you can teach yourself how to meal very accurately by going through a couple of these every time you go to the range. So next, if I go, all right, the target's 435 meters. So I'm going to play with my meal until I get to whatever meal gives me 435. This is 0.7. So I have to get my reticle to see 0.7 or get my eye to see 0.7 in my reticle to match the math. All right. So very easily you can teach yourself how to meal very accurately by just doing two or three of these each time you head out to the range.